here, Jeff. I mean, the first time you come to visit me, I've been asked to come since college. I know. And I mean, I've told you, if you ever had to come, you were to come along with mom. I never wanted him to come. I hate him. You don't hate him. I hate him, and you know that. I can see. I mean, I've worked so hard in my life to have this kind of shit. I know, but... I've told you, I'm on deadline, Jeff. Yes. I've told you, I've called, I've talked to you about how I feel. I mean, you know... I know, I know this, but... I don't know, but why is it so hard for you to actually respect me? Yes, I'm your sister, you're supposed to look after me. I do look after you. I went. I went with our kids. You always like to do whatever you want with me. You call this looking after me? That was a long time ago, Lizzie. I don't want to talk about it now. No, I never want to talk about it. Okay, let's talk about who paid the rent last month. Give me a break, Lizzie. And that, do you have any thanks from either your mom? Mom, she thanked you. She did this. She called you. She called me not to thank me, she called to cry. She's always crying. Because you're never around to help her. <sighs> That's not true. Look. No, you look. We're the only thing she has, and you know that. Why can't you stop her? Us, and they have the men in town. Why you always blame me for everything that ever happens? Why don't you blame mom? She's the one who brings everybody to the house. You think you are the only one who had the things that happened to you, Lizzie? You don't care about that about what happened to me. You always care about everything that happened to you. Okay, Jeff. I have dreams too. Oh yeah, what kind of dream do you have? All the dreams your many had always drink away. You grew up just like mom. That's something we promised we'll never do. I keep my promise, why didn't you? I don't know. Look, Elizabeth. I'm in trouble. That's why I'm here. It's a big trouble, okay? I need your help. What kind of help is it? I need money. Jesus. I'm sorry, I'm sorry, Lizzie, but <laughs> I didn't know where else to go. You are the only one, the only person I know with money. I don't have any money. You have to. You have to. Just Jeff, what did you do? I can't tell you. I can't. I mean, I thought I had to go to Mexico, okay? I thought Danny. I talked to Danny to wait. But he doesn't know anything. Don't tell him, okay? Hey, you, all th you think it's a big party. And you know me. I can't do anything alone. Jeff. Please. Please, Lizzie. Who else would ask? It's bad. It's really bad. I've got my stories to my mom. Great. It's only three thousand. Jesus. No, that's all I have for the rest of the year. What about your roommate? What about her? She always helps you, doesn't she? Yes, but Jess and Jeff, what did you do? You can't tell me, I'm your sister. I really can't tell you. You wouldn't love me anymore. Oh, no, please. There is nothing, nothing you will do, I swear. I mean, no, there's one thing, there's one thing I'll do, and I will do it now, okay? Please, don't ask me any more questions, okay? What I need now is to sleep, okay? Will you let me sleep? I haven't slept the whole night, okay? And then you get the money, right? Huh? And then you get it, and then me and Danny will go, and it will be like you're never here. I promise. Hmm? The bed is in there. Okay, go. Cool. But I need you and Danny gone before Karis come up to work. She doesn't understand things like that. Okay. Will you, will you entertain him while I'm asleep? Okay? You know how restless he gets. Sure. Seriously, Lizzie. I okay. need him here when I woke up. Yeah, okay? I know. I know. Don't I... let him talk you into any of his shit. Jeff, I'm not a kid anymore. It's okay. It is a bad. Jeff, it's okay. Go get some rest. I will take care of it, okay? It is a bad. I love you. I love you too, Jim. 
Giorgione di Bonaparte. Mannaggia, mannaggia.